In this video, quick farm fix for 4x4, 4x4 stop working or it doesn't work on your B2600i Mazda pickup truck. This is 1992 when we got this truck, 4x4 didn't work and it's getting cold. This is December 3rd, we are getting more snow, ice and you need to go around the farm, get a firewood, get a few things done without having a working 4x4 truck is pretty much useless right i'm going to share with you everything what i did to make the 4x4 work again this is just sharing the information so what worked for me and might help you i'm very glad if it will okay you shift it to 4x4 all good by the way before we'll get started please go and subscribe to the channel very very appreciated that and click that notification bell you won't miss any new interesting Mazda videos okay and when you someone when the driver is trying to rock the truck back and forth you truck got stuck you see here is your let's turn the flasher on okay here we go be careful well, and you can see your uh, uh, propeller shaft turns and here's your transfer case if you look here there's another one it's going to the front axle and that one turns too and why i don't have the 4x4 oh well the answer is simple because this truck has remote front wheel mechanism which is controls the front axle all right i'm going to show you how it works and you will understand what i mean okay this is our uh, remote free will mechanism, RFW. How it works when vacuum supply to this vacuum actuator, this rod pushes the fork and moves this gear sleeve over the output shaft and that engages the front axle. And you have a switch and a cab. Just a little bit of theory, just a couple of minutes. It will just you push this it locked you have a control module here for the mechanism that's one of the part and then you have that vacuum lock solenoids and two vacuum lines coming down and you have your vacuum box and <laughs> get further in all right and vacuum lines coming here, vacuum supplied, fork moves, locked, and you have front wheels engaged. But it's not in case. Okay, what I did, right, straight to the point, guys, now. All right, because there's no vacuum, when we got this truck, lines were cut off, I actually connected them, didn't work. What do you do? You just pull this rod out. It will go probably like just about an inch or so, a little bit under, an inch out, and wrap the this steel wire and just wrap another end around this torsion bar spring. But that way we just simulate the what vacuum will do to lock this front end, and well fork will move and. Uh, relocate that uh, sleeve over the output shaft gear and that way you got your 4x4 this is only for farm use you don't want to go on the highway with a locked front end like this and when you switch to the 2x4 at the transfer case you won't get the torque transfer to the front end but your front axle still will be locked if you don't need it you just go on and undo the wire and then we'll unlock the front end and then you just uh, try to shift to two by four all right you got it in next videos we're going to troubleshoot this system completely and get it fixed properly but as i said that's a quick fix what works for me farm repair for now and just sharing the information and uh, yeah subscribe to the channel stay safe See you soon guys, take care, bye bye now.